Patricia Luna showed us the generator she just bought ahead of this latest heat wave. She's glad to have it, especially since she had no idea her power would be cut off. Luna says without it, her home would be too unbearable for her elderly disabled mother who lives with her in Monterey Park. Hotter than, hotter than you would ever believe. I mean, even if you put the fan on, it would blow hot air. We have air conditioning back there for my mom, which was, if we didn't, I would be on the verge of my mom having heat exhaustion. She's one of thousands of customers in the county who lost power due to the intense heat. Across town in Baldwin Hills, stoplights were out, causing a slowdown on local streets. Nearby businesses also closed early. Employees at Rainbow Shop said they took a bit of a financial hit because of the power outage. We can't ring anything. You know, our customers are unhappy. We missed our goal. It went off for like, I want to say like 10 minutes, maybe even less, and it came back on and then it shut off again. I know all of our customers, they were mad. Cal ISO officials say conservation is key. If you're staying home, set your air conditioner to 78 degrees or higher. Don't use major appliances between 3 and 9 p.m. Close your blinds and drapes and use a fan. A flex alert is already in effect through Monday. Cal ISO says it's trying to avoid rolling blackouts like what we saw during last month's heat wave. In Monterey Park, Candace Crone, KCAL 9 News.